Hello everyone, I'm Jessica and today is gonna kind of be my July TBR but also kind of not. For the month of June I picked, I believe it was 13 books that I wanted to read for the month, uh, two of those being TBR box picks. And I, while I read 11 books during the month of June, they weren't necessarily the books that I had picked for my TBR and also I didn't read my two box picks because I, because I didn't, okay? I'm, no excuses. Because I didn't. I was in the mood for other things, so I read other things. Okay. For the month of July, I am, <laughs> as I say this, it sounds ridiculous, I'm not setting a preset TBR because I'm doing Camp NaNoWriMo, but I'm also going to be doing the final biannual bibliothon, and I'm also doing the reading rush, which was formerly known as book do -thon. So, I have two readathons going on this month, and a write-a-thon, and so I'm not setting a TBR outside of that. Let's roll with that. Okay. What I am going to do is I'm going to try to read through the leftovers from last month if I can. And I'm also going to pick two new box picks because I normally like my box picks, but last month they were both classics and I just, I don't want to read the classics and I, but they're still on the list and I'll try to read them this month. So I'm not picking books for the weeks on the outside of the readathons. I'm going to try to read during the readathons and maybe I know I'll work through a few books um, when I'm not on the readathons. And so I'm going to pick a couple TBR box picks. I'm also going to be reading a lot of arcs this month. I have three September arcs and one July arc that I actually just got the other day that I need to read, which is uh, Lineage. And I've also got arcs for The Babysitter's Coven, Rebel Girls, and Seeker by Kim Chance. So I have plenty of arcs to read through, plenty of leftovers to read through, and I'm going to pick some TBR box picks. And there will be separate videos for my TBRs for the Reading Rush and the Biennial Bibliothon, which is why I'm not spending a lot of time talking about that here. I'm just going to pick some TBR box picks and roll with it. So if you have never been here before and you've never seen me do this, I have a division. I have books that were bought prior to 2018, and in 2018 I bought 209 books. It was a hot mess. So these are my post-2018 books. So these are my 2018 books and then anything I've bought this year if I have remembered to write it on a piece of paper and throw it in here. It's here. I have actually already read 52 books this year so the likelihood that I pull something I've already read is pretty high. The likelihood that I pull a classic because my TBR box hates me is also pretty high. So we're gonna go pre-2018 first and see what happens. Our first pick is... Really? This is the route you took, Box. I swear to God. So if you weren't here last month, my TBR Box picks for last month were The Handmaid's Tale by Margaret Atwood and Emma by Jane Austen. I legitimately just fucking pulled Persuasion by Jane Austen. I don't even know. I feel like I'm being punked by my own TBR box. Look, does anybody ever get that feeling? <sighs> All right, box. Bring it on. Like, I have very few classics left on my shelves. I have some Bronte sisters. I have a little bit more Jane Austen. I think that's it that's unread. I have, I'm, I'm not a huge classics fan, so I don't buy a lot of it. All right, post 2018 it is to beans. Something just fell out. Do we risk it and pick the one that fell out? <sighs> Alright, let's do it. Oh, I haven't even opened it yet. I feel like I'm being punked already. Replica. Oh, that's that Lauren Oliver one. Is that the one where it's the same on both sides but it's like two separate stories? To the bookshelf. So there you have it folks, Persuasion by Jane Austen and Replica by Lauren Oliver and it is the version with two covers where you get to pick which way you want to read the story. I don't want to read the story twice. Why did I buy this? What I did like about this that I, I can understand why I actually bought it 
I'm like, now I'm like, I don't want to read it twice, but I, I do grasp the concept that I bought it because it, it is kind of an experiment on a way to write where she has two different perspectives telling the same story and each individual person's ideal of what actually happened in a situation is different and you could even hear things differently or see things differently than what the other person does. So I don't know grasp the concept, but I'm sure there isn't an audiobook for this because how would you read it? Like, because you get to choose how you read this. And I cannot read audiobooks for classics because I fall asleep. Thanks for that TBR box. Like, at some point, I'm going to have to start getting, like, things I actually want to read out of the box, aren't I? I guess this is what I get for, like, the first few months of this year where, like, I was pulling out books that I already had on my TBR or I was pulling out things that I had already started reading the month prior and hadn't finished yet. There were a lot of like very um, fortuitous pulls at the beginning of the year and now I'm getting shit. So I guess that's fair. Again, I will be posting separate TBR videos for the Bio New Bibliothon and the Reading Rush. So make sure you look out for those in the future. And let me know in the comment section below if you have a TBR box, TBR jar, TBR teapot, TBR, whatever you have. I like to watch people read them and have that look of defeat on their face, much like my own. When they pull out books, they know they don't want to read. That is all I have for today. I post reading, writing, and book related videos on Mondays and Wednesdays and bonus videos on the weekends and in the month of July. I'm going to be posting both Fridays and Sundays because I have a lot of content this month and that's just how it goes during a nano month and you get to benefit from that. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and if you don't want to miss anything I have going on in the future, make sure you subscribe and until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye!